Hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to my channel, Perfumes with Pat. Um, so I was watching a few of the YouTubers' um, channels and they were talking about some of these perfumes. Charlene Ford was talking about um, Penn Halligan. Um, and Joe sent me, um, he on Instagram, he was talking about Afnan Supremacy. Um, so I wanted to try them. So I bought a few samples and I actually, you know, blind bought two of the fragrances and I wanted to share it with you. Um, I'm going to put their links um, in the bio. You could just check them out. They, they have wonderful YouTube pages. Okay. Um, so the first one we're going to start out with is Afnan um, Supremacy. And I've never heard of this, but let me tell you, I wore this two or three days to work and oh my goodness. It's absolutely beautiful. I'm not going to give you any notes or anything. Um, I'll do that on a later date. But the bottle is kind of corny, but I love it. I love the bottle. I think it's so cute and sexy. It's gold. It's heavy. I love it. Um, let's try it. He, he went on. Joe sent me went on and on about this fragrance. And let me tell you, he was not wrong this thing is so beautiful and it's perfect for fall for winter for the colder seasons because it's it's heavy it's very it's spicy it's peppery it's warm let me tell you this is one of the sexiest scents i have smelt in a i mean i and guess what this bottle was like 35 dollars 35 dollars and the juice inside is like if you're buying a $300 bottle of perfume. This was so wonderful. I cannot um, wait to try the others. Now, I told my dad to buy um, Supremacy Silver and I went over to his house yesterday. He said, Pat, I love it. So try um, these this brand out, this house out, Afnan Supremacy. You will not regret it. It's so beautiful. It's like, sitting by the fire with a nice pie with some whipped cream and some coffee. I don't drink coffee, but like some tea. Oh my goodness. Wonderful. That's Afnan Supremacy. Thank you, Joe sent me. That was right on. And this is Penn Halligan. Um, this is Vera or Vara. I haven't tried this as yet. I sprayed it um, yesterday, but I didn't wear it for an entire day. I got it yesterday and I sprayed it yesterday. I just thought it was so, it's hard to come out. Oh Lord. So beautiful. Um, when I smelt it, I didn't really, it, it's, you know, I, I didn't really care for this. Um, it was just okay. It smelled like I don't know what it smelled like really and I didn't look up the notes but I didn't really care for it you know it, it's not like it was horrible like liquid diamonds it's just yeah it's just okay yeah it has to I think I have to just wear it and see how it goes um Vara so okay and then I ordered this little sample packet from Penhaligans and this is how it came in this beautiful little, you know, box. I got this on Tuesday, I believe. And I only try, I only wore two of the scents. Oh, so it has like Juniper Sling, um, Blenheim Bouquet, How Fetty, um, and Moine, and Impressa. I only wore How Fetty and Impressa, let me tell you. Chanel Ford was going on and on and on about how beautiful Impressa is. So, you know, I really had to try that one. And she compared it to like Chanel. And she's right. This thing is so beautiful. It's a light, it's airy. It's like if you're going to have tea with a friend, if you're going to. It's so beautiful and it does put you like in the same luxurious mind as um, Chanel. It's, but this is on the light side. It's so nice. It's super beautiful. You should try this. This is Impressa by Pen, 
Penhelligan. I'm so happy that I bought this. So this is definitely, um, I did tell my sister to buy me this. <laughs> yeah. So yes, definitely full bottle worthy, um, which I definitely will, you know, get. And Helfetti, I heard Latifah, um, Jennifer Latifah and I am Gids. I asked him his opinion on this. He has a um, YouTube channel also. I am Gids. He's wonderful. But Latifah loved this fragrance. And I said, okay, I want to try it. And Gids said, yes, that's a really good one. Let me tell you, I wore these two days. And I don't even want to spray it. It's so beautiful. Oh, my goodness. This is... So Baccarat, like I said, is my number one scent. I love Baccarat. This is my number two scent. And it might even be in the same place as Baccarat. I absolutely loved it. From the time I got into the building at work, everyone was like, what are you wearing? And everyone was like, oh no, I have to get that. How Fetty is, oh my goodness. I've never smelled anything this, it's like, it's a scent that makes you make you happy. I can't explain it. It's like, oh my goodness. Ooh, it's so, it's cozy. It's really spicy. It's peppery. It's so beautiful. It's splendid so well. Like whatever, I haven't looked up the notes, so I can't tell you what's in it, but whatever they put in this, oh my Lord. Oh my goodness, it's so gorgeous. Like, yes, I'm definitely going to get a full bottle of this one. I have to have that in my collection because I'm doing a new thing. I'm trying not to buy things that I, even though I bought the, the Vera, I bought it for the little, um, the packaging, but I'm not going to buy things that I really don't like because it's a lot of money, you know, and times are too crazy to be wasting money, you know? So how Fetty? It's worth it. Men, women, like every single person in the building was like, what are you wearing? It's really beautiful. Even though those that didn't like perfume, you know? So um, I did, tr I only sprayed um, the Juniper Sling. I didn't, I didn't, yeah, I don't know if it's for me. I probably have to try it, like wear it and, but yeah, I don't think it was for me on, you know, the initial spray. It's definitely not um, love at first sniff for me. But like I said, I didn't wear it for an entire day. But, and then um, Blenheim Bouquet. Yeah. You know what this reminds me of? Like when I go to the Ritz Carlton and they have the tea tree soap and the shampoo for your hair. This is exactly what this smells like. So like, this is actually a really good air freshener. It's the, the, the scent is really refreshing, but I don't think I want to wear this as a, you know, a perfume. But the scent is beautiful. It reminds me exactly like that scent. Okay. And the last one is En Des Moines. Yeah, En Des Moines, En Des Moines. Actually, you like this. It smells real fresh and clean. Kind of like a soapy scent. Like if I, you know, like a nice fresh soap. It, it, I think it's supposed to be like a body spray. Not necessarily. It's actually really refreshing. But I, I want to buy a full bottle of this, you know. But the Halfetti and the Impressa are wonderful. I love it. Um... I will wear the others, you know, for a few days just to see how I feel about it. This one is not bad, but I don't think I will wear it like as a perfume. Okay, and that's it. Um, 
I love this house. Um, the Halfetti and the Impressa, oh my goodness, they're wonderful scents. And the um, Afnan Supremacy, for the price, even if it was two, three hundred dollars, it would be well worth it. It's absolutely beautiful. And what makes it even better is that it was just thirty, thirty-five dollars. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. So thank you, Joe sent me. Um, and that's it. Um, that's it. Thank you for watching this little miniature haul of mine. Um, if you would like to buy, I got these purchases actually at Fragrance Net, who I'm affiliated with. Um, you could click the link in the bio and purchase whatever, you know, you like, you need. I do get a small commission from them. And also, um, this beautiful automizer I got from Amazon and I'm one of their influencers. Um, so if you wanted to purchase one of these, I do have a link also for this. Okay. Um, and that's it. Um, thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule just to come and watch this thing. <laughs> if you have any comments, please write a comment. Let me know what you like, what you don't like. You can dislike, you can like, um, subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. Get your family members to subscribe if you like to see more, you know, more of this content. Okay. Um, thank you so much for tuning in. Bye-bye, beautiful people.